guys, it's Vanessa. Welcome to my channel. I used one of my favorite colors from my Naked palette. And the color is Sidecar. And then I just smoked it out a little bit with another color. And that was about it. The other color was actually a NARS one. But you could have easily just gone in with like something like Smog or Dark Horse. It looks just like this. Really, really like this look. So keep on watching and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Okay, so the first thing I did is I primed my eye with Urban Decay Primer Potion. And then I went in with Maybelline's Color Tattoo in um, Bad to the Bronze. And it's just a bronzy, neutral kind of shade. And I just did that to prime my eye to for the base color I'm going to use. And I'm using my Naked Palette. And the first color I'm going to go in with is called um, Sidecar. It's a really beautiful um, brown shimmer kind of color. And I'm going to put that all over my lid. And I'm just going to pat it on because there is a lot of glitter and it may have fallout. So I'm just going to pat that on. That's about it. Next I'm going to go in with a fluffy brush like this. And I'm going to go in with um, Soft Brown by MAC. With this one right here. And I'm using this one just for a transition color in my lid. I mean on my crease. So I'm going to start here and bring it up and it's really going to warm up the crease. You can also use a naked palette. You can use um, naked but that one is just more brown toned. This one is a little more on the peach kind of brown side. I'm going to use a NARS eyeshadow in Galapagos and it's a really shimmery brown color. I do have a few dupes for this color. Let me know if you want to know or I'll just list it down below in the description box. But I'm just going to use this color. And this color I'm just going to put right here on the outer corner. I'm just going to push it down like this. Make sure it's touching my lash line and bring it up. And then go in a sort of like a diagonal line up to my crease. You can see where my crease is, so it's going right up to my crease and then right down here. So you can see that V kind of shape I created. And again, right up in a diagonal. And I'm just going to blend that out softly. I'm using circular motions and just back and forth. Now I'm going to go in with my highlight color and my brulee color from Wet n Wild. So I'm just going to grab some on my brush. For the inner corner, I'm going to go in with another matte color, but it's bright. This is the Estee Lauder Porcelain Matte. It's a really just vanilla kind of color. And I like this one because it makes my inner corner just pop, but without shimmer. For my lashes, I'm going in with a coat of my Clinique High Length Mascara. And then I'm going in with a coat. This is for length. And then I'm going in with a coat of my Tarte one. And this is for volume. Hi guys, I'm back with the finished look. And I'll zoom in really quickly to get a quick look. It looks like this. It's a really simple, smoky um, eye look. And I kept it actually really bronze with my face. I just felt like going pretty bronze today. I'll show you the products I use on my face. I used, I have already a sample of it. It's a Laura Mercier Tinted Moisturizer. Um, on top of that, I put on my um, blush. It's a cream stick. It's by NYC and it's called 646 Urban Spice. And this is like not as much as a blush as it is a bronzer actually. But I just put that on my cheeks because I felt like going bronze today like I said. And I really like the way it looks. So yeah, I have this on my cheeks and it is pretty shimmery but not like ex excessively shimmery. I went on top of it with my cargo powder because this is pretty matte and like yellow base. Oops, sorry. This is pretty matte and like yellow base so I just like kind of just pat my face down because I was pretty shimmery. Pat it down with this and then I went in with my NARS blush and Dowser and this is a matte blush so there was no more shimmer on my face. Um, for my lips, I put on just a, a lip balm, and then I put on my nude lipstick in Innocence Beware. This is by MAC. And just to add a little bit of color to my lips, because it was pretty nude, I went in with a little bit of my one of my favorite lipsticks by Rimmel from the Kate line, and it's the number 08. And 
And then I went in on top just with the gloss. You can use any kind of gloss I like. I use like a peachy kind of one. This is the Tender Tone by MAC called Hush Hush. Any gloss would be fine. I just used this one. And because I'm such a freak, I went in with another gloss. This is the NYC New York Color in Downtown Brown. It looks like this. They smell so good. So I just put this on because I was bored and I'm crazy like that. So I went out with a so many of the products, but that was way too much. I just felt like putting it on because this is new. I just bought it. So I was like, okay, I'll put this on. Okay, I'll put that on. Put this on. Just put on a whole bunch of crap on my lips. But I really hope you guys enjoyed my tutorial and leave any questions or comments below and I'll get back to you guys.